Okay. There we go. I think I've got some settings figured out here. Learning a little bit each day. Level 8 monk, here we go. We last left, I was bringing some stuff to the bar keep here. Um, and I was headed to Amberstill Ranch. Um, Amberstill Ranch was here, I handed the ranch. That's where I have to go now. So I'm taking off as we head out. Let's see, Lachmodan, Iron Forge, and Vilmar. Well, None of those signs help me where I'm going, but I know where I'm going. Let's see, I'm equipped with some boots, shimmerweed boots, Wendigo leggings, frostmane belt, stained gloves, bracers of angular momentum, just a trainee's vest and a fallout cover. I took this two-handed staff. I haven't fought with it yet. I don't know if it's really going to slow down my attacks or not. Let me fight this little wolf and see how it works. So again, I don't know if that helped or didn't help, um, but just get a few uh, crag boar meat for when I want to make some stuff. The um, the beer basted boar ribs. What's this place? Engineering supplies. Came across a mysterious house. Music starting to get engineering trainer. Ooh, can learn how to make gizmos. Okay, I will make a gizmo. Yes, I would like to learn engineering. I Means what we do. Okay. Um, so what did I just do here? Beer basted boar ribs. Oh, I still have to learn how to cook. Um, but that's that's for turning in stuff. Um, I think I need to learn how to mine also. Because engineering is going to require metals, I believe. It makes sense for it to require metals. Let's see here. No, uh, P? Professions, here we go. Engineering. Rough blasting powder. I need some rough stone. Linen cloth and blasting powder. So, hey, I have linen cloth. That's exciting. Okay. So maybe we can spend some time engineering. I'll be a crafty gnome monk. That'll be fun. Covert ops. Oh, this takes me right there, doesn't it? Oh no, this took me somewhere I didn't want to be. I gotta, I'm gonna walk. One of these guys sent me, and I don't think they want to talk to me anymore. I think I have to walk. A long, windy road to Amberstill Ranch. Tumble gnome. Tumble gnome. So it looks like I have to have so many dots. It requires three chi to do this blackout kick. So that's something to remember. I can't just do it when I want to do it. But now I have four chi and blackout. Some stringy wolf meat off of that wolf. So I need to speak with Sergeant Flinthammer at Amberstill Ranch. That's where I'm headed. Um, Amberstill Ranch. Okay. 
Love it. You can hear the footsteps. I don't know if you can hear the footsteps. I've been working on my sound settings, trying to get that delicate balance between game sound and me sound. What are you? You are a snow cub. I have two of three. Am I supposed to collect three? Switch pets. Ouch. Shadow Slash. What does this do? That's going to tick. And then... Uh, three. Oh, I did not mean to kill it. I did not mean to kill that snow cub. Where's the ranch? Um, I feel like, okay, it's over there. Oh, I see, I have to go around the mountain. Tumble gnome. And up the hill we go. Oh, what's going on here? Looks like there's definitely a fight to be had. So you're the one who's been helping Captain Theron beat back the Frostmane trolls. I've seen your name in the reports. It's good to finally meet you. You might be just the monk we need to help secure the ranch. Well, look at there. 50 quests completed. Wow. It's raid night every night. The reports I'm sending Captain Theron can't really convey the amount of trouble the Frostmanes have created for us. Your assault on the village has started to relieve some of the pressure. The raids are still frequent, but the trolls don't have the numbers they once did. Even so, my men are tired and their morale is flagging. Would you help us keep watch for the Frostmane raiders? They could turn up at any time. Help him and his mountaineers defend the ranch from Frostmane raiders. I'll get boots that aren't any better than the boots I'm wearing. Hmm. But I'll get a lot of experience. So defend Amber Still Ranch. So I'm assuming. Okay. I see what's going on here. This guy's gonna try to. Um. That's a lot of dudes. Can't hit him yet. When do I get to hit them? Defend Amber Still Ranch. I'm trying to figure out how to defend it. Oh, I see what's going on here. They stole our rams and we gotta get them back. So... Come on. Get. Okay. Punch. Punch. Kick. I don't know what happened to auto attack here. But I'd like it to come back. Oh, I guess it's not. Oh, is it because of my staff? Tumble gnome to the rescue. Wow. That tumble was awesome. Okay, we have defended Amber Still Ranch successfully. With your help, we've managed to weaken the raiders considerably. They haven't suffered such losses since the raids began. Now's the time to press our advantage. Oh boy. Ram Breeder. The rams we raise and train here at Amber Still Ranch have long been the mounts of choice for Dunmarog's mountaineers. I, there are a few here, but not enough to guard my family and the animals. A brave few Frostmane raiders have taken to stealing our rams under the cover of night, taking them into the south tundra hills. Would you be willing to help return them? 
you'll need to get fairly close to them and give a sharp whistle to get their attention. Their training will take over from there. Recover six stolen rams from the tundred hills by using forward slash. And Rudra Amberstill of the Amberstill clan. We heard the cries in the middle of the night this morning. Then this morning, sure enough, dastardly, uh, the herd was missing two rams. That dastardly beast known as Vagash has been preying on our livelihood. With Ironforge's troops already spread thin, there's one, no one to keep Vagash at bay. Perhaps you, have brave, you are brave enough to seek out the beast and slay him. Bring me one of his fangs and I'll reward you. Vagash lurks just above the ranch here, but be warned, he is deadly. I'll get a, uh, obtain his fang and I'll get a tunic. Okay, deal. Um, let's see. Hey, hey, Mr. Zrock Guru. How are you? How are you? Hopefully the sound is a little bit better today. I've been trying to fix the audio between game settings and mic settings. So I'm off to, oh, I'm off to fight this guy. Hope it goes well enough. He sits atop this hill, I guess. Oh boy. If that's what he can do to big beasts, what business do I have fighting this guy? All right, well. I don't want that. Oh, I did not want that to happen to me. I got you. I'm going to rip out his fang here in one second. And rip. Take that. Vagash, the gnarly. No more eating our rams two at a night, like midnight snacks. Okay, now I have to go whistle for some rams. It says they're down here somewhere, and then I have to literally forward slash whistle see how that goes. Oh, there's a ram. Whoops. Whistle. Man, are you kidding me right now? I did not want to fight. I just wanted to whistle. All I wanted to do was whistle. Awesome. That was cool. No. No. She's a faster whistler than I. She must be Whistler's mother. It's a terrible joke. I do not want to fight that guy. I just want to whistle. Come on. Guess you have to have them targeted to whistle at them. They can't hear you otherwise. That's a little weird to me. Don't really want to fight an ice claw bear. So yeah, mm -hmm. I guess I'm fighting an ice claw bear. Regardless of my want to fight an ice claw bear. So Mrs. Brock, Mr. Rock's guru, what are you up to? I'm just trying to Live the gnome life, you know what I mean? Fight a bear, whistle at some whistle at some missing rams. Oh dear. Oh, here's one. Here's two. Okay. I must say, like, if they stole the rams and they're this highly trained, why can't I just stand in the middle of the field and whistle really loud? 
and then they'll all just go home. Just lost a druid at level four by falling asleep, so taking a break. Okay, I get you. Yeah, I don't have a lot of time today. I just wanted to finish these Amber Still Ranch missions and then uh, maybe fly to, ooh, a copper vein, fly to Dunmorog like I've been needing to to start those missions in the uh, in the Dwarven City. I see it. I can see it. I started mining and engineering because I think like a good gnome, any good respectable gnome, should be engineering, tinkering about, making gadgets and whozy what's-its and whizmos and whirly poppers. Because what gnome is worth his gnome ship if he doesn't do that? I'm going to mess with one of the um, settings here for sound. That's that. Dialogue. Ambiance. Try that. Okay, um, so let me turn these in, and then if I fly to Dunmarog, it looks like I'll be done for the day. Just a little bit of time today I had to get a few things done. Uh, oh, it's under attack again, mysteriously mysterious. I'm not going to mess with that. What can I get for you today? What can I get for you? The rams you rescued have made their way back to the pen. I've got members of the family on a day and night watch again. Those trolls won't take us by surprise again. Watch your back. Watch your back. Oh, thank you. Vagash still terrorizes the herd. Please help us by killing the wretched be- Oh, sorry. I did. Very well done, she says. Varen will be so happy when he hears the good news. To kill Vagash is no easy task. I imagine one day you'll be fighting alongside King Magni's men on the Alliance front. Watch your back. And just like that, my reputation with Nomergon is increased. Ironforge is increased. I'm honored with Ironforge now. 1300 experience. Oh, oh no, not another quest. There's always another quest. What can I do for you? Help for the quarry. It says, uh, thank you again for all your help here, Pepper's Pants. I have a cousin who used to work in the mines beneath the Goldbar, Goldbalar quarry, but he hasn't been able to work since Trogs flooded into the mines and took control. The quarry and its camp are just to the southeast of the ranch. Would you be willing to check in with the foreman there and see if there's anything to be done? I will accept your quest, but, mister... Well, there's a, there's a bird there. Okay, fine. I will walk there to meet up with the griffin, take that guy's quest, then fly back to take the other guy's quest to fly back and keep flying and call this area complete. It's cold. I'm running from bears are chasing me. I'm just a lowly monk. What's a monk to do? Oh, didn't mean to do that, but I guess it worked at this end of the day. So here we go. Trying to find the quarry. Saw a snow leopard that I don't want to get in a tangle with. Hey, here's the quarry. <clears throat> oh boy. Quarry and some quest givers. Okay, listen. Listen, quest givers. I want your quests. I really do. But I've been neglecting Ironforge quests. Trogs, I swear the gods put them in this land only to torment me. Four inches deeper into the mines than two feet back from the trogs. Sergeant Flinthammer? I'm not familiar with the name, but I there is a Flinthammer among the miners. He's one of the ones lucky enough to make it out of the mine, but most of my men are still trapped down there. Okay, so I think I should accept these quests to remind me to come back here, and then 
fly out to Ironforge to finish up that list. So let's see here. Those blasted trogs. Those light blasted trogs turning my work site into a wreck. Look at that. There goes another barrel of powder. Oh, I wish I could go down there and wring every one of their scrawny little necks. I want to kill them all. This can't be good for my health and all this stress and anger. What have they left me with? Nothing. I'd kill them myself, but my aim's no good anymore. You go into the quarry and kill some of those filthy buggers. I'll pay you. Just hurt them. Kill them. Kill eight rock jaw skull thumpers and eight rock jaw bone snappers in the Golbalar quarry and it's mine. All right, buddy, listen. You're looking kind of pale. I'll help you out, but not right now. I got other places to fly. You know what I mean? You take me to Karanos. All right. So I'm flying atop the Griffin back to Karanos with me to turn in this quest that's going to send me up here. Whew. Day in the life of a gnome, you know what I mean? Gnome what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. <laughs> So as I fly overhead, the frost main front, I already defended that. Good, that'll be a good quest reminder to, to keep me coming back here. Okay. I've landed here. I can talk to this person for my honor students. Have you had your fill of Karanos so soon? Are you ready to leave for another city? I am. You've got to get this to Ironforge, eh? For a small fee, I can put you on the back of one of my griffins, and it'll take you there. How does that sound? I like the 975 experience. For just a few coins, one of my griffins will take you to Ironforge. From there, deliver the Grimlock's list to Golnir Bouldertoe. You'll find him in the Deep Mountain Mining Guild. That's in the Great Forge District of Ironforge, which is right where my griffin will drop you off. Speak to me again when you're ready for your journey. I'm ready for my journey. Here we go. Let's go finish this quest once and for once. And then it will be time for me to rest Pepper's Pants the Gullible one more time. Beautiful city of Ironforge built deep within the mountain. The domain of King Magni Bronzebeard himself. I mean, just look at it. Would you look at that? Just look at it. Would you look at it? All right. It's time for me to go find Boulder Toe. I wonder if he's in any relation to the Hammer Toes. Hey, Rex, how are you today? How's the sound sounding today? I think I figured some things out. Look who I found. Boulder Toe, don't mind me stepping on your stuff here, buddy. Great to meet you. If you ask me, there's no greater profession than a miner. And if you ask me, there's no greater miner than a dwarf. Hey, buddy. Ride to Ironforge complete. Here's your list. Ah, the latest list of Gremlock's best pupils. I have a batch of honorary cleavers ready to go. I just need to engrave the names of the students. Griff Thurden. Here are the honorary cleavers for Gremlock's students. If you've already been to Karanos, then you should fly a Griffin back there. Take the cleavers to our Griffin master, Grith Thurden. Speak with him about a ride back to Karanos. Okay. So now, I take the cleavers. So you're saying it's a bit too low? 5 to 10% low? But better than used to. Cool. I like that it's better than used to. I do have to um, 
fix the music is a little loud for my taste. Okay. Can try this setting and see how the sound gets you there. Great to meet you. Now you look like you have somewhere to go. Need one of my griffins? Why, yes, I do. You have to get these to Karanos, eh? That won't be a problem. As long as you've already been to Karanos and spoken to Broland Galebeard, then you can take one of my griffins back to him. Well, let's hop to it. Return to Grimlock. For a small fee, you can buy a griffin ride to Karanos. As long as you've already been there, griffins will only fly you to places you've already been. Be sure to speak with every griffin master you see so you can fly to him later. You've already been to Brolin, the griffin master of Karanos, so now you can return to him. And once in Karanos, you can deliver the cleavers to Grimlock Pilsner. Speak with me when you're ready to go. Oh, I'm ready. Safe travels to you, buddy. I am on my way. Okay, I can barely hear it on the stream. I'm, I'm turning it up in very small increments because I had such a problem with it yesterday. So, um, turn to ground. Oh, I'm right here already. That's a quick flight. I wish airplane flights were that quick. Okay, I think I finally get to be a cook now. Tumble gnome, tumble gnome. Okay. What can I do for you? Return to Grimlock. Ah, Pepper's Pants, have you returned from Iron Forge? I have. You brought me the cleavers. Great! I'll get these to my students. I'm sure they're eager to use them on some fresh boar meat. Thank you for your help, Pepper Pants. I am in your debt. But I hope this money will at least cover your travel costs. Watch your back. Yeehaw! Level 10, ladies and gentlemen. I can now pick a new class specialization. Click here to view your specialization choices. Cheer for this guy. Cheer for that guy. Okay, so now I want to be a healer. No, I don't. There we go. Mist Weaver. Okay, I don't think much changed. <laughs> Soothing Mist heals the target for 184 over 7.9 seconds while channeling. Okay, so I just put that here, I guess. What's this do? Oh, escape art. That's right. I'm a gnome, so we're good at escaping. Okay, so is it time to cook? Can I cook now? Great to meet you. Yes, I can cook now. And I can cook spiced bread and herb baked eggs. Okay, um, so maybe... Let's make some charred wolf meat. And some, well, let's make some bread though too. Cooking, uh, learned spice bread. I just need bread and mild, or spices and simple flour. So do they sell that stuff here? Great to meet you. No. Hmm. Better learn how to make bandages too. What can I do for you? I can't make bandages. Keep your feet on the ground. Keep your feet on the ground, buddy. What can I get for you today? Well, you can get me some bread and or some spices and some flour. Be good. You be good. This is not helpful. Maybe down here they have some spices and flour. No, just a couple of beds. 
I will go to sleep there, though, and I can't... Oh, I almost missed you. Secret place? Or more beds? Man. You got my attention. Off with you. Okay, fine. We're going to do this the hard way. Roasted boar meats. More roasted boar meats. Okay. Now that I've done that, I can go out here and sell some of my food. What can I do for you? Tough jerky. Hmm. Oh. Get rid of these. I can sell all this stuff. That's what I just made. Um. Trainee's vest to armor. Hardened leather tunic for his armor. Why am I not wearing that? Ooh, that's cool. And then 41... Three armor. Three armor. So why not sell these? Bear meat, rough stone, copper ore. Okay, I think I can make something with... Hey, rough blasting powder. Look at that. One, two, three. And now I can make dynamite. One, two, three. All right, look at there. Already becoming a useful gnome. Um, I think it's time to put this gnome to bed. Uh, bear meat is for cooking. Yep. I think I'm gonna put this bear, this gnome, to bed. Into bed we go. <laughs> can you like f sleep? That'd be funny. You can! <laughs> that's pretty funny. And that's where we'll leave him. Hope you guys have an adventurous day yourself. Um, got a scram for now. We'll leave Pepper's Pants there in the inn. And catch up with his adventures starting with level 10 tomorrow i think i start to get a mount at level 10 maybe it's 20 i'll double check that you guys have an awesome day